Kelly. I am gonna go through this Amblin Magnetic Lashes Limited Edition box with you guys. Ooh, oh my god, fast hands. So today I'm gonna use this IML Laurel Green Repair Soothing Cream. Recently I've been loving this cream for my day cream and it's a gel type kind of moisturizer so it is non-sticky super duper glowy as well it's very very hydrating this brand is um a new brand that i just brought in at shopkakatan.com um not here to do any form of like promotion just want to tell you guys um my favorite product as of late and also uh, this Laurel Green series is vegan and um, all the ingredients are also EWG certified so I'm very happy to be bringing in items like that. Something that I, you know, I will use very often and I bring in things that I have tried so this one has been um, in the testing period for about like two months now or even three months so it's great, all's been great and today I'm gonna use this new item that I've been seeing tons of people using on TikTok so this is the Dr. Jart Sika Pear Recover okay so this is the mini version and I have been telling Sakura that I really want it um, and she surprised me for my Christmas present um, so this helps with soothing irritated sensitive skin and then it also helps with covering up, you know, the redness and all the blemishes. So let's just go ahead and try this. Just like that. And then I'm gonna put it on. And like what they say, just put it on your palm first. So when it is on your face, right, it is green. And then when you um, blend it in and melt it in your skin, it will turn into your normal skin color. That kind of like cancels out the redness. Actually is quite fair for me right now. I don't, I'm not sure why I'm trying to like put it up to my dark eye circles and we shall see. Because I really cannot believe this. Thank god I didn't get the full size because I don't think it actually works though. Okay. I got the new Hourglass palette. This is the holiday palette. Like what I told you guys, I always get the holiday palette every single year. So last year we have the ghost palette and then this year this is a golden one that looks amazing. And then I got the mini size one because I don't need the big one and this is the unlocked version. I actually like the unlocked version a lot more because the color is a lot more solid and it's more, a lot more opaque, it's not so shimmery if I were to bring it up and then show you guys that this is a little bit more opaque and this one has a lot more shimmer I'm gonna do a swatch for you guys first so the first one would be the finishing powder this is in soft light this one looks like that ooh, I like this powder, it does not have shimmer and then second one, it's the bronzer and this bronzer, I think it's a lot cuter than the previous one because this does not have shimmer. Oh yeah, it has very very tiny bits of shimmer but as you can tell, it's close to my skin colour. And then we have number 3 which is the blush. This blush is called Mood Flush. This, oh my god, this mauve tone. Ooh. And then lastly, we have the most exciting champagne stroke. So the last one is the most exciting one which is the highlighter. This is the champagne strobe. Oh my god! Look at that shimmer. I've been wanting this unlock palette for a long time. And then um, if you want to compare, right, you compare the uh, bronzer right beside this unlock bronzer. You can tell that this is a lot more cool tone for the ghost palette. And then um, we don't really have like a crazy crazy highlighting shade. Maybe we'll try this right beside the more pinkish highlighter. And then as compared to this year's Unlock palette, this is very champagne and gold and I love it. I've been wanting to try it out with you guys but I totally forgot about it because I left it in my stash right behind this big ass mirror so totally forgot about it forgive me but right now i'm just gonna try it with you guys the bronzer and it's so small 
and portable. I feel that I'll bring this and use this a lot more than the other palettes because usually when I buy the holiday palette, right, I usually buy the big ass one. But this time brown, I wanted this because I feel like I have a lot of palette already. So I'm just gonna try out something smaller. Okay, okay. We're going for that bronzy look. And you know, I freaking love um, hourglass items. Even the mascara is great. If you guys have not watched my mascara try on video, I actually have like a battle of mascaras for you guys. I have part one and part two. Part one was very well loved by you guys. So I put out the part two and you guys should go watch it if you love mascara and you like um, makeup like me. Oh yeah, so have you guys set your New Year's goals yet? I usually do goals um, per quarter, so I won't be overwhelmed with what I have to do per year. I actually have like a system. If you do by Q1 to Q4, right, uh, you just have to come back every three months to review your goals, which I think it's a better system because in that way, you can give yourself little milestones towards your goals and if you have a change of mind and goals um, in the middle of the year right you can just change it but I mean that's my type of goal system so what is your system in setting goals I would really love to hear it so Sakura and I we actually did a podcast for you guys talking about setting our New Year's goals and what we have achieved and what we have not achieved in 2020. I mean this year has been crazy because of the pandemic, right? Firstly, I mean like because of all this unexpected situation, we also turn to desperate measures in our lives. A blusher with the same brush because I am lazy as just gonna lightly I haven't been able to just sit down and talk to you guys about new makeup and things like that because I've been saving money I started saving up because of the pandemic and previously I did a video of how much I spent within a week and I'm very very ashamed previously I was in a state where I do not have any savings so I literally like spend every single cent of my salary but right now, I think I should do an updated version because I need to stop all you haters for laughing at me and also like show you guys what I have been spending my money on because uh, a bulk of my time is spent at home right now. So I don't really have too much expenses on anything. Okay, lastly with the champagne. This is the highlighter. Ooh, look at that girl! Okay, verdict, I love this one. So now we are gonna open this limited edition box here. This is actually super worth it. This whole box is retailing at 109 sing dollar. And inside this box, we will have the signature pouch. Okay, and then the instruction menu. And then we have an eyeliner. An applicator which is in Tiffany blue, I'll show you guys in a bit. The usual one looks like this, um, black one with rose gold. And then we also have an eyeliner, we also have um, eyelash setting essence which is to put it on before you put on the magnetic lashes so your lashes will last for the whole day. The lashes actually last quite a while. I think it lasts for five to seven hours for me. And then I always bring my applicator out so I can just reapply it. And I really like it because it has no glue, it has no like magnetic um, eyeliner thing that I have to bring. And it's just so easy. And whenever I wanna like remove it, I'll just like take it out and then go to bed. Easy. And I don't have to like use um, makeup remover to remove anything on my eye so there's no gunk or anything. If, if you have sensitive eyes, you don't want to use mascara, you don't want to use any glue or any form of eyeliner, I highly recommend this and we have so many different designs for you to choose from. Okay guys, and this is my new favourite lippy. This is the Glow Recipe Lip Balm. It's in the watermelon flavour and it has this nice pinkish tint. It smells awesome and I love lip balms. 
cute. So usually, right, one of these magnetic eyelashes and the applicator, it actually costs about $88. But right now, we have an extra four items, one, two, three, four, and it all costs up to $109, which is such a steal. Four more items for only $20 top up, I think it's a great deal. We have the eyelash box, so this is essentially the original Mland box. It's super compact and it has a pair of lashes here and also a mirror. So you can bring this out with you if you're wearing lashes itself. So right now, I'm just gonna use it with you guys. This box is so cute. I swear, if you guys uh, want to get something for someone, your loved one, your girlfriend, your wife, just your sister or anyone that loves beauty, right? I think this is a gift that is so appropriate. And also look at the packaging, it looks so cute. It actually kind of looks like Chinese New Year packaging. So Chinese New Year is around the corner and this would be a really good gift. I would be so happy if anyone like get me this, to be honest. For this limited edition gift box, we only have two styles. One is a Taiwan Camellia flower and then the second one is Fresh Fairy, which I will be showing you guys. So I'm gonna show you guys Fresh Fairy and Taiwan Camellia. I'll put them on, one on each eye, so you guys can see the difference. So Fresh Fairy here and then Taiwan Camellia here. Taiwan Camellia is my favourite and I also love Popular style and honey camilla flower. However, for the limited edition gift box, we only have these two designs, which um, I think a lot of people would like as well. Can you guys see the comparison between these two? So this is Taiwan Camellia and that is Fresh Berry, and they are quite different. So if you want to go for a fancier look, and you guys know that I love my lash extensions, right? Just that like it always jets with my real eyelash. So that's the con about eyelash extensions. So I'm gonna show you guys how I put this on. I actually did put out a video of my MLAN tutorial. That is actually for my customers but if you guys are keen to watch it I'll link it up here. Okay so first thing you're just gonna put the top one on top of the applicator like that. And then Put the bottom one right below. It's quite foolproof. And then all you have to do is to... My trick is always this. Chin up and look down and then you widen your eyes and then for this part, this part it should be towards your eyeball here. So you can just like put it here first, um, align it and position it and see if it's comfortable. So you can just do this. And remember not to jab into your eyeballs. So I always widen my eye and then I look down and then I just clip it in like that. And there you go. You can see my eye looks a lot more defined and I just love how it looks. So your goal here is to clip the false eyelashes as close as to your lash line so you won't have any gaps here like so and then you can just like see how much of a difference I have and I really really love um, the magnetic lashes because it's so handy and then if you don't want it you can just like remove it like that and then I will wear the Taiwan Camellia one to show you guys actually Fresh Fairy it's such a cutie okay and then I have Taiwan Camellia on my left eye so I'm just gonna show you it's so easy to be honest and I really love this Tiffany blue one. Um, so only with the limited edition box you are getting um, the Tiffany blue applicator. I think it looks a lot more slick and I love blue. And then again, look down, chin up. And then go. So there we have it. So um, Taiwan Camellia, it's a lot more sparse and it's more like everyday look. And then for Fresh Fairy, it's for you girls that love the fancy voluminous look. So they both suit me really well. And then I feel like today I want to use um, Fresh Fairy to the party. I really love this. Okay, so right now that we have demonstrated this, I am going to show you guys the items that comes with 
it. I'll start off with the eyeshadow stick. So it comes in a dual shade like that. It's uh, a shimmery pink on top and then below it's uh, a coffee brown. Easy to use. This is how it looks. So the shimmer pink and then bottom it's dark brown. You You can go over it a few times. Looks like that. Alright. So this is the eyeliner. And this eyeliner is in dark brown, I think. It looks so cute. Oh my god. Wow. You can extend it like that. Woo! And then if you don't want it to be so long, you can just like push it down. It looks like that. This eyeliner is in dark brown. Ooh, look at how precise this is. Oh my god. And it dries up really quickly though. Super natural brown. The Lash Setting Essence. So this essence helps to assist the lash makeup as a transparent mascara and it actually holds the lashes a lot better I'm just gonna put it on if you don't like too much, just coat your lashes with it just one click and I'm done difference with lashes and without So I have both sides done. Okay, um, I hope you guys like this video and if you guys like it, remember to like and subscribe down below. And if you guys want to get the Mland Magnetic Lashes set, I will link my store down below and you guys can go get it on my store or Shopee. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye!